guys you know what time it is quick discreet simple questions let's go after it do these quick guys you know we gotta go through it quick so this is 27 pick the answer write it down 28 pick the answer write it down 29 pick your answer and write it down 30 pick your answer and write it down i think that is it. okay cool so go ahead pick your answer guys play this the cp auto mall right a sip of water all right let's see stimulation of the iris dilator muscles a result of activation of sympathetic motor neurons okay dilating the eyes allows more light to come in more light coming in allows me to see everything clearly in case i am being attacked or in case i gotta go and run all right that's how you remember it 27 is a i don't even gotta look at the other ones increasing plasma concentration of aldosterone is most likely to be followed by which of the following aldosterone is going to save salt aldosterone it increases sodium reabsorption in the dct in the distal comminuted tubule okay and because it uh, reabsorbs sodium water is going to follow it okay a increase water reabsorption through increased aquaporin channels in the collecting duct no that is what adh does adh antidiuretic hormone does this okay so this is wrong you should also know that ADH does this, okay? Increased sodium reabsorption in the distal, yeah. Decreased water reabsorption in the collecting duct. No, we have an increase in absorption. Decreased plasma calcium concentration. Aldosterone has no effect on calcium concentration, okay? The answer is B. When normal human cells are grown in culture, they will divide a limited number of times, typically 50 rounds of mitosis. After this number is reached, the cells become apoptotic. The cell death is a result of what? Decreasing number of membrane-bound organelles per cell. No. The organelles don't cause cell death like this from mitosis. Decreasing number of non-membrane-bound organelles per cell. No. Again, whether it's... There is... Red blood cells have non-membrane-bound... They don't even have organelles. Okay? So, it's not B. Decreasing level of growth hormone. And that could be it. Eh, maybe. Chromosomal telomere shortening each round after a round of division. This is correct. Okay, this is the telomeres theory. Okay, as the telomeres get shorter after numerous amounts of mitosis, this tells the DNA to stop replicating. Okay, the DNA recognizes that. It's like, hey, I cannot replicate. I don't have telomeres. And so instead of, you know, potentially causing mutations, in the DNA and being passed down, the cell's like, okay, I'm just going to go undergo apoptosis. I don't want to risk passing down some mutations. So apoptosis, when those telomeres get shorter, those telomeres get shorter after numerous rounds of mitosis and division. A student finishes an experiment involving several bacteria which are highly pathologic in humans. She wishes to dispose of the agar plates and micropipette tips she used. Which of the following procedures should she carry out? Microwave all materials? No. Why would you microwave them? That makes no sense. <clears throat> Wipe down all materials with a hundred percent ethanol solution. Okay, that could work. That could, that kills bacteria. Place all materials in an open metal container and autoclave the container. Yes, you guys should know what autoclave is. The process. Okay, that process. You put the bacteria under very very high amounts of temperature, like I believe it's like 130, 130 degrees Celsius. And not only do you do that, but you also put an insane amount of pressure on them. I believe it's like two atmospheres of pressure. And that's going to kill all the bacteria. I don't know if you guys have worked in microbio or took microbio, but that's what we do to kill the bacteria. You autoclave it. Okay. Place all materials under UV light for 90 seconds. Maybe that'll kill some, but you could have those that are resistant to it. So the answer is C. Bam. Let's check if we got them all right. Sympathetic. Motor neurons, B, correct, D, correct, C, correct. Good job, guys. See you guys in the next video.